Youth runner here with uh, Colorado State standout, Lars yep. Mitchell. We're the 38th Roy Griak Invitational. Just finished the Merrill Fishbine Gold Race. Great second half for you. Uh, fantastic uh, last uh, few K uh, to really close in on Muhammad yeah. there. I'm sure if this thing went to 10K, <laughs> maybe we might even see a different outcome, but we'll save that for November. Yeah. 25.01. Uh, 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 how encouraged were you about like just the patience early and then you know how much you were rewarded in the ground you were picking up late? Um, you know, a lot. I mean, it's an 8K, you got to run all eight. And I've in the past kind of been a back to front runner. And this year, I just have a lot of confidence. Of the this past year, just having a great coaching and great team around me, it gives me a lot of confidence to know I can run in the front, be patient, and not to be, be too worried early in the race if gaps start to form. I know I have a good, strong second half, teammates behind me backing me up. So that helps a lot in a long race like that. I mean, uh, I mean obviously, you know, uh, we're only on uh, September 20th, uh, obviously. You know, big things. Uh, well, how, 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 how much uh, have, the have you felt like you guys have accomplished, like, champion, the just in, you know, in training, you know, and, uh, and, and, and through minutes, 55, you know, the, the time in, seconds for you know, in the August championship, and early September, Lars Mitchell just to kind of set yourself up uh, for, uh, for a day like this, minutes, right? Because it's kind of, it's in segments, seconds. right? So Definitely. how much do you feel like you accomplished Hunter to get ready for this opportunity? A lot. You know, you kind of build that big summer base, staying in Fort Collins training together, just team chemistry, the Navy, confidence, in the leads us into position, that first race at Wyoming that we do up there. Mason Quick 5K, Wyoming get the jersey on, and then, you know, it's about just getting better meet to meet. Place. So we circle this on the calendar, set a goal for it, but uh, also know Colorado, this isn't end season, this isn't regionals. Colorado, so you need those benchmarks throughout the season, but we're going to keep improving. we got another four weeks to pre-nats, and I'm very confident you'll see an even better team at that. Finishing in the eighth position, I'm glad you talked about being at Wyoming. Wyoming. Obviously, Wyoming. that was only 5K, this is 8K. Yeah. You know, uh, but seconds, to have Carson, no guys like Jacob and Mason and Ryder yeah. uh, along with you guys, I mean, I know you're not you know, seconds, minimizing it down to a dual meet, but I mean, Jackson obviously, it's familiar now, faces and whatnot. Yeah. Like, was, 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 that, was that kind of just like a, you know, a reassurance Finishing or clarity for you that it, and for position. your teammates that it's like, hey, these are guys that we're going to see at conference and at regionals and Lord willing health providing at NCAs, but like, was that good to be around those guys just for familiarity? Yeah. And, and even Mohammed as well, because obviously he'll be in the regional. Yeah, definitely, definitely. I mean, these are teams that you need to know certain guys on certain teams are your two through threes where you stand on our team and head-to-head -head those battles for conference like Wyoming, then regions like Utah Valley. Really good indicator to make sure we're still improving. And also a nice benchmark in these races. It's not just teams we don't know where we're at and kind of, you know, just running – for times or splits, it's cross country. We need good places, and so having good teams like that and guys to chase down could help you improve throughout the season. Awesome. Lars, yeah. stay healthy. Well done today. Thank you. I appreciate it.